In this video we are going to talk about top 8 friendliest sea creatures around the world. So before starting this video like this video and subscribe to Adify for future updates. Pets. They are the most reliable of friends. Pets have been an integral component of the average person's life for centuries. Pets' primary functions are to provide their masters with companionship and amusement while also warding off potential threats. The three most common domesticated animals kept as pets are dogs, cats, and cattle. Every domesticated animal has demonstrated the value it brings to human existence. Guard dogs not only keep the house safe but also assist law enforcement with their work. Mice are kept away from stored grains by cats. Cattle are essential to farming and are the primary animals used to produce dairy products. The graceful nature of fish has the ability to relax people. The beauty of birds as well as their songs have a calming effect. There are a wide variety of other animals that humans keep as pets. The vast majority of them are terrestrial animals. However, there are some marine creatures that could become your closest companions. Due to the fact that they live far away from human civilizations, people had no intention of petting them. These creatures are in no way dangerous to human beings. They can also be of assistance to people in certain situations. Let's find out more about some of those friendliest creatures. Number 8. Tiger Sharks. Tiger sharks, on the other hand, have a reputation for being quite sociable, in contrast to the great white, which you probably wouldn't want to meet eye to eye with unless there were some metal bars in the way. They have a reputation for being overly curious at times, but if you give them a gentle nudge, they will move out of your personal space. Make sure that you hand over your friend before they attempt to take it from you without asking for it first. Number 7. Sea Turtles. There is no experience quite like watching a majestic sea turtle swim by in real life, it is truly a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. A visit from a sea turtle will put a smile on the face of any nature lover, whether you see it on shore during the sea turtle nesting season or from a boat while on a fishing charter or dolphin cruise. Sea turtles nest on beaches all over the world. Long lifespans, the ability to see underwater, and migration patterns that can take a traveling turtle thousands of miles at a time are just some of the adaptations that this ancient marine species of the Gulf Coast has developed over the course of its more than 100 million years of existence in the oceans of the Earth. The following five species of marine turtles are found in the Gulf of Mexico the most frequently. Green Hawksbill Leatherback The Ridley of Kemp's Loggerhead. Even though you might see a sea turtle at an aquarium like Panama City Beach's Gulf World Marine Park, on a boat tour, or during a snorkeling excursion, it is best not to bother them in any way, even if one photobombs your picture. Sea turtles are endangered, and it is important to do what you can to protect them. A turtle that has been stranded on the beach requires a lot of room in order to recover. The only time you'll ever see a sea turtle on the sand is when it's time to lay eggs, which is a highly delicate operation that must never be hampered in any way. Number 6. Jellyfish. There is a location in which it is safe to swim alongside jellyfish without the risk of getting stung. It is appropriately referred to as Jellyfish Lake, and you can find it in the Palawan territory of Rock Islands. It is completely risk-free to take a dip in this body of water because the jellyfish that once lived there have lost their stingers sometime in the past 12,000 years. You are allowed to get very close to them, but you must avoid the temptation to touch them at any cost. If you do, you run the risk of hurting them. You only need to put on a snorkel, and you'll be ready to go. Number 5. Manta Rays. Two of the best places to see manta rays are the islands of Tobago and the Grand Turks. These bizarre-appearing animals congregate in both locations throughout the year and aren't afraid to get relatively close to the shore when they want to say hello. They lack stingers, which distinguishes them from stingrays. However, you should avoid touching them because the protective membranes that cover their bodies can peel away when they come into contact with humans. They should be concerned about us, not the other way around, therefore, show some consideration and refrain from trying to pet them. Number 4. Hammerhead's Sharks. Hammerheads may have a menacing appearance, but they are not typically aggressive and actually enjoy swimming close to humans while they are underwater. 
you are safe to pet them and feed them without fear of being harmed. In the event that you are interested in giving hammerhead diving a try, two of the best places in the world to do so are the Galapagos Islands and the Cocos Islands. Bear in mind that even when they're friendly, they're still predators, so if you go down with them, you should do so with an experienced guide. Number 3. Whales. The massive species found in the ocean is not harmful to humans in any way. There are a few species of whales, such as humpback whales and gray whales, that are suitable for keeping as pets. Only a small number of humpback whales will approach boats. However, they exercise caution when around boats. These whales are very creative and outgoing in their communication. They put on a number of different shows, one of which is called flipper swapping. Even more renown has been brought upon them due to their songs, which can be heard by snorkelers. Some of the whales will swim up to people and even allow them to touch them. They look for human surfers to ride with. They are the motivation behind the operation of sightseeing boat tours. The size of whales can be quite staggering. Therefore, there are many considerations that need to be made prior to petting an animal. Number 2. Manatees. One of the two subspecies of manatees that can be found in the Americas is known as the Florida manatee. Although they are most commonly observed in the freshwater estuaries of central and northern Florida, Florida manatees are adaptable and can live in either brackish or pure saltwater. This allows them to travel to locations all over the Gulf of Mexico and even as far north as New England. This gentle giant species is known for having a kind demeanor, and although it is an omnivore, the majority of its diet consists of sea grass and other forms of marine plant life. Because of their large size, sedentary behavior, and friendly demeanor, manatees are often jokingly referred to as sea cows. Even though swimming with manatees is widely regarded as a rewarding experience, it is important to avoid disturbing wandering manatees or manatee groups by getting too close to them. Not only are they easily startled, but they also have a propensity for heavily defecating in the areas in which they spend time. Number 1. Dolphins. The bottlenose dolphin is by far the most well-known of all the marine species that live along the Gulf Coast. Dolphins are not only one of the most intelligent and contented animals in the world, but they are also one of the most sociable animals when it comes to interacting with humans. In their forays along the coast in search of tasty mullet and playful antics in the wake, pods of bottlenose dolphins can number anywhere from 10 to 25 individuals. Dolphins are naturally very inquisitive animals that typically do not show fear when interacting with humans. It is not unheard of for one or two to approach people swimming or riding jet skis in an effort to find a companion to play with. Dolphins and people are known to have a mutually beneficial relationship in Panama City Beach, which is located in Florida. Pods will either hang out at the pier in anticipation of being fed scraps from fishing boats or they will follow fishing boats in the hopes of finding a good location to hunt. In return, many local businesses depend on these aquatic natives to provide personal encounters with Panama City Beach dolphins, sightseeing tours, boat tours, and snorkeling excursions for their customers. What do you think about this video? Do let us know down in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go.